Hi there, my name is Jennifer Cohen and I'm the Secretary of the Delaware Department of Transportation. I'm here to introduce you to a very important construction project along I-95 in the city of Wilmington. This video will address some of the improvements as well as some of the related traffic impacts. The work will take place on the portion of I-95 stretching from the I-495 intersection through Wilmington to north of the Brandywine River. Our mission here at DelDOT is to make sure that every trip in Delaware is safe, reliable, and convenient for people and commerce. And that's exactly why this project is needed. Good news is construction on the project isn't supposed to start to 2021, which gives us all plenty of time to plan. The project should take approximately three years to complete, and we know there's going to be significant traffic impacts and delays, and that's what this video will address. DelDOT does not take this lightly, and we are doing everything in our power to minimize the traffic impacts and delays during this project. Safety of our contractors, our citizens, and our employees are our number one priority, and this project will increase the safety of I-95 and the longevity of the interstate. Please continue to watch this video and know here at DelDOT, we continually strive to provide excellence in transportation. If you drive I-95 into Wilmington, road improvements are on the horizon. Starting in the spring of 2021, a six-mile road construction project will start, stretching from I-495 to north of the Brandywine River. A portion of this stretch of I-95 is the Wilmington Viaduct, or bridge, crossing railroad tracks, parks, and city streets. This section of I-95 was built in 1964, widened in 1978, and is starting to show its age. This nearly three-year project will enhance safety, roadway efficiency, and ultimately extend the life of the road by more than 30 years. Before work on I-95 begins, a new ramp from 2nd Street will be constructed. Both the existing 2nd Street and South Jackson Street ramps have been identified as needing safety improvements. In early 2020, these ramps will be closed while a new, safer on-ramp to I-95 southbound from 2nd Street is being constructed. The merge lane will be extended, which requires widening the Wilmington Viaduct. This work will last approximately 12 months. The new ramp will be completed prior to the major I-95 work, and will enable the ramp to remain open continuously during the I-95 work. It's important to emphasize that this is major road work with major traffic implications. Delays are expected. You will need to plan accordingly. If these repairs are not made in the near future, DelDOT will have to completely reconstruct this section of I-95. The subsequent traffic impacts would be much more significant and the cost would increase dramatically. DelDOT has devised a detailed plan that updates and improves the existing structure and extends the life of the roadway for at least 30 years. The work will include removing the current surface using hydro demolition and replacing it with a specialized protective layer. It will include replacing the roadway barriers or parapets. The new parapets will meet current design requirements. Additional work includes improving the bridge joints eliminating 15 of the 60 joints using state-of-the-art ultra-high-performance concrete. An added benefit to Wilmington will be additional improvements to the city. These improvements are currently being defined through cooperative discussions between DelDOT and City of Wilmington stakeholders. Initial construction is scheduled to begin in March of 2021. Most traffic will be impacted in stages two and three. While some of the road work on I-95 may be out of sight, the traffic impact will be front and center. During stage two, the northbound side of I-95 will be completely closed. Two-way traffic will operate on southbound lanes. The public will still be able to access all parts of Wilmington. However, it is strongly advised to use alternate routes. Stage two will last approximately 10 months. Stage three will start in the spring of 2022. Northbound side will reopen with two-way traffic operating on the northbound side. Local traffic will have one lane on the southbound side, while the other southbound lane will be closed for repairs. Halfway through stage three, the local lane and closed lane will flip. Stage three will take approximately one year. An additional lane will be added to Lancaster Avenue and 2nd Street, allowing an additional left turn lane. North Adams will be re-striped in order to provide two left turn lanes. The additional lanes and re-striping will be completed prior to the major I-95 work and will provide congestion relief during the I-95 road work. Road improvements are on the horizon for I-95 in Wilmington. Expect delays. Plan ahead. DelDOT, striving for excellence in transportation. Every trip, every mode, every dollar, for everyone.